I feel like personally, the first question I've always wanted to ask you was like, how did Real Elements come about and what was the energy behind it? Because we don't know the story and what was that like? Okay, so in 1955... <laughs> 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 hey, man, this is a comedy show, bro. <laughs> <laughs> No, I do these things because my wife doesn't think I'm funny. So no. I hope someone's taking a video so I can take this as proof. I just blame you. See, my life and my segets. Yeah. Um, I think I. Well, personally, I've, I've always been. I think since I was young, uh, my dad actually is a storyteller, poet, and also musician. Okay. So yeah, he always used to play guitar at home, and we we'll sit together as a family. He would uh, play songs. My mom would sing. My sisters, and then I started picking up the guitar, and then started playing organ uh, in the Catholic church. Okay. My <laughs> uncle was an organist. Uh, so he started teaching me a bit of uh, organ, a bit of theory, so and like then lungs and liver. <laughs> <laughs> Swiftly moving on. But you just want limba. Organ in the limba. Oh, yeah. damn! I yeah. didn't know that. Limba. Yeah. <laughs> Oh yeah, yeah. Uh, that was for those people who think Sintra <laughs> was <laughs> Um Yeah, so pretty much, I think I had the support of the family. Um, yeah. And then secondary, I jam. We might say the only boys, three years champions, jan <laughs> jan. Um, and, and then stripes. <laughs> Yeah, and then high school, did a lot of music there, and then I went to study uh, music in at the Liverpool Institute for Performing Arts. And when I was there, a friend of mine uh, who was in Manchester uh, told me about another guy called Louis, who was a rapper. I think he was in London and just said we should link up, and that was Marvel. Okay. Yeah, so when I was in uni, I... I went there as as a musician, so playing keys, that was my first instrument. Uh, and then I changed to music production uh, mm -hmm. later on. So I started making a couple of beats in school, I would work with some, some artists. And then when this friend introduced me to Marvel, uh, he sent me like, I think a recording, he was just rapping over, I think it was an exhibit beat or something. Mm -hmm. And then I was like, hey, let's meet up. So I sent him some beats, he wrote us a couple of stuff. And then he came to Liverpool and we went into the school studio and we recorded, I think, two songs. And then we started the group. That was in 1999. Yeah. So Real Elements started with myself and Marvel as the founding members. Sure. Yeah. Now wow. the, the energy was, yeah, it was it was crazy, you know? I can imagine. Um, yeah, I was... Yeah, I was on those beats, man. <laughs> <laughs> and Marvel is one of the baddest lyricists. Oh, facts. Yeah, facts. That I've ever yeah, come man. across. Facts. Yeah, legit. So, yeah, it it just worked. And then later on, I think we did an EP called the I Came EP. I uh, had I think four tracks, and then we came to Malawi. Uh, I was on holiday, so we all came back, uh, and we decided to launch the EP here. And Marvel linked up with an old friend of his, Analiku, they were in school together. Um, that was Plan B. Mm -hmm. So we started doing some performances with Plan B as our DJ. Okay. Yeah, and then we heard about this other kid, Wawuji <laughs> Jiri. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, what was the name before David? Jerome. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I said it. <laughs> <laughs> He's gonna say a lot of things. <laughs> no, 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 Jerome. Yeah, that was his name, there, Jerome Kalilani. Yeah, um, mm -hmm. and he was he was in the states with his moms, yeah. and he had come back, and he had uh, put out a song called Body Snatcher, and we heard it was like, hey, snap, who's this kid? Actually, to tell you the truth, this kid was bad. Yeah, mm -hmm. and we were like, mm, guys, Ababa, we should. Uh, no, let's see if we can, because the kid was bad. <laughs> yeah? Yeah. So we all hooked up and we recorded a song Kwa Studio Goodson Gomonda called Astronomical. That was the first track that everyone was on as real elements. Mm. So, and uh, the energy was just like on point. We're just like, you know what? Let's do this. Let's, let's, let's make this a group. Let's make this official. So that's how, yeah, that's how it came about. Yeah. That's crazy. Yeah. Jerome. Crazy. Jerome. <laughs> Jerome. Yeah. Now, David. Here first. now Pastor David. Now Pastor oh, yeah. David. Yeah. yeah. Then his 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 stage name was linguistics or just no, sticks. sticks. Yeah. 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 Bad, bad MC, man. Bad, bad, bad MC. Bad yeah. But how is it? Like, how is it? Um, 
performing the, the EP in Malawi. Where, where, where were you performing in Malawi? Where, where, we did. Were Malawians even listening to like? I mean, I know, I know we're listening to rap because I bet there were like a few local rappers, but. Yeah, it, it, it was, was like, where are the rappers then? No, it was a very interesting time. I think when when RE blew up, there was uh, Bantu comrades. 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 Yeah, yeah. 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 Mm-hmm. So it was like they were the authentic guys doing the Malawian thing, and uh, yeah, it was a bit of heteration because we were there, you know. High school kids. High school kids. <laughs> 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 and I'm a ding dong. Ding dong, rapping in English. <laughs> Tell you sound yeah. Like, yeah. yeah, that's another story. Yeah, so we we, we launched the the I came EP Ku Blanta French Culture Center. Okay. Mm-hmm. We did a show at the Shack, uh, but when we did uh, French Culture Center, yeah, <laughs> what this is what. 2000 Chavoti people flossing about selling out. We sold out French country. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Raptors. In the year 2000. I think. Crazy. Yeah. Or if not Crazy. 2001. Yeah. Crazy. Yeah. Dynamite and them. Yeah. Dynamite was around. Um, actually, yeah. And that time, yeah. D1 was around. Yeah. Uh, they, they had a crew called uh, KRT. Um, who else was around? Whew. Kenny Clips as Kenny a DJ. Yeah. Uh, Gwyn's was around, but you know, the, but we weren't the first, to, the first to do it. You yeah. know, the way you, there was a long history of 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 artists who who had been doing it. I mean, Criminal A, Taki T. If you the history speak to Taps, he's got so much history. Um, Wisdom. Yeah. Wisdom, late Wisdom Chitedze. Mm. Yeah, late Wisdom Chitedze was, yeah, he, you know, the Tipewe was, uh, yeah, yeah, it was, was quite yeah. a big song. Yeah, it, was, it, was, it was quite a big song true. then, yeah. Yeah. All right, interesting. What's the next question? <laughs> <laughs> anyway, uh, anyway, so um, before we get from like, we, we get into the actual Malawian music and how far it has come, I would like to know how did where what happened to real elements i could have asked that question myself <laughs> <laughs> i knew that's where you were going mm. um i've got two answers i have the philosophical answer that says when you don't consolidate your vision as a group yeah. uh individual visions will come around and then by the time you want to consolidate you know you're so far gone with too late the individual visions that yeah. you can't come back and uh, look at what you were on. But to tell you the truth, there were issues. Uh, we were young. Um, we didn't have proper management. Mm. We tried, um, but yeah, it was it was tough. Um, no proper management, no proper direction, I would say. Creatively, we were on point. Mm, you nice. know, uh, the performances, the music, were on the recording side, but in terms of being organized and charting out your career path, mm. we didn't have that. And yeah, we did we did some really, really amazing things, a couple of tours in the UK, performance in Tunisia, Kenya, South Africa. Um, and, but for that big break, it didn't happen. So I think there was a lot of frustrations and when that happens, you know, you start looking at each other and blaming each other. Yeah. And then um, I've forgotten the year after being in the UK for a while and things weren't really, really happening. I was studying, so I couldn't leave. And then the rest of the group decided that they want to come back to Malawi, but I couldn't. So I was just like, okay, cool. Uh, so I got out. Damn. Yeah. Do, do, do you think that they... But, they, you know, I got out, not because they moved to Africa. I got out because <laughs> there was issues in the group. In the group. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. yeah they part, partly blame you as well for 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 the the group. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Splitting. Yeah, yeah. Because um, you, um, you decided the, um, to remain in the UK. No, 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 no. Not because I decided to remain, but uh, I think a lot of blame went to me. Okay. Yeah. Why? I don't know. I've forgotten. <laughs> <laughs> no, but, but if you ask, if you ask me, like, okay, here's a story that goes around. What's okay? What's the story behind the deal? Because we heard there was a deal, there was a big deal that came to your table, and you guys turned it down. I don't know how true that story is. Big deal from who? 
Sony? No, you know what? I've heard I've heard there's some real elements myths. <laughs> yeah, I've heard we went to the States. We met, I think I had Dr. Dre's producer. Yeah. Oh, somebody. Oh, yeah. 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 I was like, even in Paganaba, no, but I've never been to the States. <laughs> <laughs> Are you for real now? Yeah, no, that, that, well, according to me, when yeah. we were the four of us, um, there was no, there was no record deal that was offered. Never ever? No. Well, that is very good to no, know. No, I said when there were the four of us. Okay, oh, okay, okay. Yeah. So, <laughs> thank you. You were real elements. Yeah. 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 I don't know. I don't know because we didn't talk when when the group split. Oh, when I split from the group, yeah. we didn't talk for like a very long time. Okay. So I don't know exactly what happened to who when I. All I hear is. Anything that is just speculation, but yeah. I don't know for facts what really happened after that. I I, I focused on my career as a music producer and songwriter, um, yeah, which was pretty damn good. I can't wait. Greed. Greed. Do you want 